quality of life is a key feature of how we approach patients with MDS. Like you mentioned, like I mentioned earlier, when we try to personalize care for patients, we're not just thinking about what drugs we can use to make their disease better. We're thinking about how those medications are going to affect their quality of life. Are they going to make them more sick before they get better? Are they likely to uh, maybe improve their blood counts it's such that the patients feel better without necessarily changing the overall course of their disease? It's one of the major considerations that we look at. We know that there's several things about MDS that, that negatively affect quality of life. So one of them is transfusion dependence. So if a patient needs to come to clinic quite often to have their blood counts checked and then to receive blood transfusions, which can take many hours and have potential adverse effects, we want to be able to reverse that process and put them into a range where they're no longer requiring transfusions. So a lot of our therapies aren't necessarily aimed at curing the disease or making it go away, but are really aimed at making the burden of the disease less onerous and making patients have more freedom and less time in clinic.